Is it time to buy or sell Square stock? In this video, we're diving deep into Square. Our initial report was published on our website on Friday, August 4, 2023, and now we're here to provide you with an even more detailed analysis. Remember to subscribe, hit the like button, and turn on the notification bell to stay updated on our latest analysis. You don't want to miss any crucial updates that could impact your investments. Enhance your trading decisions by trying our newly launched AI stock analysis tool powered by GPT-4 at stockinvest.us. Tap into the power of AI and get a free price predictions and deep analysis for anyone among 25,000 companies worldwide today. Please note that this video is for informational purposes only and should not be considered as financial advice. Since August 4, 2023, our system has ranked Square as a strong sell candidate, giving it a score of minus 5.94. Let's take a look at the stock's performance during this period. We'll continue monitoring this evaluation to see how it unfolds in the coming days. The current three-month trend suggests a potential 35.36% change over the next three months, with a possible return between 35.36% and 74.55%. As for the 12-month trend, it suggests a 0.733% change over the next 12 months, with a potential return between minus 17.49% and 40.72%. This translates to a price range of $52.41 to $89.39 after a year. Our latest daily update for Square includes the headline, Volatile ride for Square stock price on Friday moving between $63.20 and $70.40. The Square stock price fell by minus 13.64% on the last day, Friday, August 4, 2023, from $73.55 to $63.52. It has now fallen four days in a row. During the last trading day the stock fluctuated 11.39% from a day low at $63.20 to a day high of $70.40. The price has fallen in 6 of the last 10 days and is down by minus 16.55% for this period. Volume has increased on the last day by 22 million shares but on falling prices. This may be an early warning and the risk will be increased slightly over the next couple of days. In total, 33 million shares were bought and sold for approximately $2.12 billion. Over the past 52 weeks, the highest price of stock was $93.19, and the lowest price was $51.34. Currently, the price is 31.84%, or $29.67, below the 52-week high, and 78.04%, or $225.71, below the all-time high on August 5, 2021 when the price reached $289.23. Analyst Ratings and Price Targets On Wednesday, September 14, 2022, Evercore ISI set a price target of 55. On Wednesday, September 14, 2022, Evercore ISI set a price target of 55. On Wednesday, September 14, 2022, Evercore ISI set a price target of 55. On Monday, April 25, 2022, Credit Suisse set a price target of 180. On Monday, April 25, 2022, Credit Suisse set a price target of 180. Analysts have given Square Stock a general buy rating. They rate the P-E ratio as strong buy and price to book as strong buy. For return on investment, the analysts give the stock a neutral rating. The following signals have been identified for Square. There are few to no technical positive signals at the moment. The Square stock holds sell signals from both short and long-term moving averages giving a more negative forecast for the stock. On corrections up, there will be some resistance from the lines at $75 and $71.07. A breakup above any of these levels will issue by signals. A sell signal was issued from a pivot top point on Monday, July 31, 2023, and so far it has fallen minus 21.12%. Further fall is indicated until a new bottom pivot has been found. Furthermore, there is currently a sell signal from the 3-month moving average convergence divergence, MACD. 
volume rose on falling prices yesterday. This may be an early warning and the stock should be followed more closely. The stock had a golden star signal on Wednesday, May 31, 2023 in the short-term chart. Golden star signal is when the short-term moving average, the long-term moving average, and price line meet in a special combination. This combination is very rare and often followed by long and strong gains for the stock in question. Here are some other signals you might find interesting. Moving average convergence divergence, sell signal. Pivots, sell signal 5 days ago. Bollinger, buy signal 1 day ago. Short-term moving average, sell signal 4 days ago. Long-term moving average, sell signal 2 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages. Buy signal 46 days ago. If we look at the 12-month chart we see. Short moving average, sell signal 4 days ago. The long-term moving average, sell signal 2 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages. Buy signal 18 days ago. Remember to go to our page at stockinvest.us if you want to find more signals. Support, Risk, and Stop Loss for Square Square finds support from accumulated volume at $60.39 and this level may hold a buying opportunity as an upwards reaction can be expected when the support is being tested. This stock has average movements during the day and with good trading volume, the risk is considered to be medium. During the last day, the stock moved $7.20 between high and low, or 11.39%. For the last week, the stock has had daily average volatility of 4.95%. Before we dive into the possible good trading levels for Square, let's quickly cover some essential fundamental data. First, the price-to-earnings ratio, or P-E ratio. This crucial ratio measures a company's current share price relative to its per-share earnings. This extremely high P-E ratio suggests that the stock could be overvalued. However, it's not uncommon for tech companies or those with huge market potential to have such high ratios. In other news, the next earnings report for Q3 2023 is expected on NOV02-2023. Analysts' consensus estimates are at $0.480. Keep an eye on these numbers, as they can greatly impact stock prices. Now let's discuss some potential day trading levels for Square. In case of an upward trend, the first resistance level for Square is at $64.61. If you don't own any shares, you may want to wait for this level to be breached before entering a position. For those already holding the stock, this could be a level to consider for swing trading. On the downside, Square encounters its first support level at $60.39. If this support level holds, it could be a good entry point, anticipating a rebound. The combined average rating for Square from multiple analyst sources is buy. Let's take a look at some recent insider trades. On July 31, 2023, Summers Lawrence Henry conducted an insider sell of 433 shares of Class A common stock. On July 31, 2023, Summers Lawrence Henry conducted an insider sell of 3,236 shares of Class A common stock. On July 27, 2023, Narula Neha conducted an insider buy of 3,024 shares of Class A common stock. On July 27, 2023, Narula Neha conducted an insider buy of zero shares of. On July 19, 2023, Esperanza Christie conducted an insider sell of 2,500 shares of Class A common stock. Based on the 100 most recent insider trades, we've calculated the insider power to be positive with a ratio of 18.081. Overall, Insiders purchased 902,927 shares and sold 628,319 shares in the last 100 trades. We have a negative evaluation for this stock and no stop loss has been set. Is Square stock a good buy? The Square stock holds several negative signals and despite the positive trend, we believe Square will perform weekly in the next couple of days or weeks. Therefore, we hold a negative evaluation of this stock.
Due to some small weaknesses in the technical picture we have downgraded our analysis conclusion for this stock since the last evaluation from a hold slash accumulate to a strong sell candidate. After analyzing the volatility and movements for the last trading day, our systems find that the current price is undervalued. For trading on Monday, August 7th, we expect Square to open up $2.19 and start trading at $65.71. We remind you that trading involves a high risk of losing money, and that you should speak with a financial advisor before buying or selling any securities. You should not base your investment decision upon stockinvest.us. By using the information, you agree and are held liable for your own investment decisions. This is our current view of the stock. Do you agree or disagree? Comment below and share your thoughts. What is your target for the stock? Remember to like and subscribe. We wish you successful trading and have a beautiful day with regards from all of us here at Stock Invest.